Grim, stop standing here. You're being very weird. I think Grim's not doing well. Grim is just hanging around in our house. Oh my god. Grim, leave our house, please. Hello? Grim, leave us. Stop being stuck there. Grim is just... Death is in the house. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Finally. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of the Bear Legacy Challenge. It's been too long, but we're back. I don't really remember what's going on. Um, I remember that the kids are going to uni soon, and it's more or less officially Gen 2 as well. And also Shigeru is literally passing away soon as well. So I'm not really very sure what's going to be happening this entire episode, but we'll just pop in and see. Also, just side note, if you want to keep updated with what's happening in my life, and whenever I disappear for a couple of months, it's a good idea to follow me on Twitter. Um, that's where I usually post like updates and stuff. Also, check me out on Twitch as well if you guys are into watching like, live streams. I stream The Sims 4 a lot. Okay, so this is literally where we left off, I think. I did pop in to give everybody a good makeover since they're like young adults now. This is Chance. Just to refresh my own memory, you guys might just be watching this straight after the last episode. Who knows? This is... This is Sorin. Um, this is Mindy and Shigeru. And this is Isla Mera. This is Chance's girlfriend. Most likely going to be the mother of our third generation. And um, here's Miki. I think we just had our birthday party for the twins. Saren is very dirty. Okay, let's go get Saren to take a good brief, brisk shower. Oh right, we have a farm. I forgot about a farm. You know, I was actually thinking that we could probably move the kids to a dorm for uni but then now that i'm looking at everything at home right i don't know if i want to i'm not even sure what the traditional rules of um what you call let's go feed do we need to feed no but we can milk because someone got eaten let's have shigeru help mindy collect microscopic sample of the cow plant at the back first and then probably milk it and then pet it and then play with it right and um what else was i talking about oh yes yeah, so i don't think i'm going to move the kids into the dormitory anymore i wanted to for a change of pace for a change in scenery but then i don't want to you know get away from i don't want to i don't want to have to why is that wait was there always one here and I've never noticed that there's been one extra... Did I put this here? I... I... Okay, I... I don't know if I... <laughs> Did I completely forget about this? Oh, is this new? I have no idea. Um, the, the dew collector thing. I am so confused, people. What is going on? Saran, go practice your guitar skills. Why not? And um, Chance, you're probably ready to just turn in. It's like 1 a.m. Where is Isla? Is Isla still here? Isla is still here. Let's just ask Isla to go home now. And um, let's have Chance go to sleep. I haven't finished an, an entire sentence since we started this. And I am so sorry. Okay, let me start over, shall we? About the dormitory thing. Point one. I wanted them to go to the dormitory. Point two, I don't want them to go stay in a dorm anymore because I don't want to leave my plants and animals alone because even though my parents might be passing away soon, um, well, they are parents, not my parents. Um, I don't want to. <laughs> also, why can't I? I want to place this somewhere accessible. Hello. Okay, never mind. And then, oh my god, I'm really just losing my train of thought again and again and again. What's happening? At some point though, I- oh, Eva Brinkley has- wait, isn't Eva Brinkley like his friend? Like the alien girl? Wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Oh my goodness, his friend just died. What happened to Eva? He was like, kind of interested in her as well. 
This is after the neighborhood stories update as well. It's been like two months, lots of things have changed in the game. I actually want to know what happened to her, but I don't think there's a way of knowing. So RIP. Anyways, <laughs> whatever, we'll just get Sauron to go sleep, poor guy. I completely have no idea what's going on in this game. But hopefully we'll get our gears back. Bear with me guys, I think we will be able to understand what's going on soon. Also, it's no longer Winterfest, is it? I'm going to take this tree away. I think we can enroll today. No, maybe later today. We'll enroll later today. I did sign the kids up for like freelance career stuff like Chance is supposed to be a freelance writer and then Sarin is supposed to be a freelance fashion photographer. I think I'm gonna do like one or two gigs and then quit because I just... I, I wanted to have them have the experience and raise some of their skills but I don't think I still want that for him, you know what I mean? Also, let's have him upload that to Fashion's Instagram. I have no idea how to do that but he did take a photo of, of Kelsey his friend. Submit photo for clients. Wait, that's not what he needed to do. Oh, we have to go to the comp- we have to use the computer. Okay. We have to use the computer to upload it to Fashion's Instagram. Okay. Why is that so weird? Oh, we have to submit for- oh. Wait, the photo is approved, but I have no idea. <laughs> Which is the approved photo? Didn't we get something approved? Because otherwise there won't be a check, right? Beside the task. Is this game bugged? I mean this game is really buggy, we all know that, but still. I don't know, we'll, we'll just see how it goes. If I get very angry at how this game has been treating me, I shall quit the freelance career without achieving anything. Okay, let's go write that children's novel that I remember. Chan's written that book twice and it didn't get registered. Okay, it's like 7am in the morning, the kids will be waking up to do their work. Pet the badger's fine. We'll just try to see if Chance can succeed at writing the book this time. And Saren has submitted the photos for approval. He doesn't really need to do much, so let's go play laser pointer. Comforting hug and pet Mickey for a little bit. I think he's very sad that his friend just died, which is fair. Um, let's go feed the chickens. And uh, Chance is hard at work. Sauron's not really. I think maybe Sauron can come and help with the plants. Sell all of the plants. I remember wanting to train uh, my kids in skills because they grew up with their parents helping them do everything. Oh, and the sink is now spoiled. Let's just get Shigeru to do this one last repair. Everything that he does might actually be the last thing that he does. He's really dying soon, look at that. Look at that. Birthday, death day, promise. Wait, is Mindy still Noyama? Mindy's always Noyama. It's so annoying. Isn't there a way to stop the game from renaming my, my sims? Because I don't- I want her to keep her last name. Do you guys know of a way? I want her to keep her bare name, especially when she dies. <laughs> but I don't want to pop in every single time to cast to change a name. I mean, this boss was happy with the work that she did from home and she made $1,100. That's great. I mean, simoleons. Oh, wait, hold on. That's for Sauron? You might be wondering why a top secret agency like ourselves would reach out to someone with as big of a reputation as you have. Why that's the whole point? People regard you so well. Who would expect that you're a secret agent if you're up for it will pencil you in to start in a lead detective role and oh by the way this conversation never happened <gasps> we're just going to accept the job offer and quit freelancing because i'm so confused with that with that career i'm not enjoying it at all and i think we saw that yeah all three of the photos that we submitted were rejected so we're just going to give up on that Mindy has gone to work, Shigeru is leading his life. Oh, that's our maid. Our maid is now an elder too. What's her name again? Wait, is she still- Oh, is she married now? Mariko Morisi. She got married and she changed her name. Okay, the one thing that's good about the game autom automatically changing your surname when you get married is when other people get married. Oh, I see Mr. Grimm here. Who is dying? Bryant! Bryant's time has come. Bye bye, Ryan. Okay, Chance is still writing. Chance, are you going to finish writing soon? Oh, he finished a book. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so can he? He has to get the book approved, right? We'll have to send this book to the client for approval, and then after he sends it for approval, he can get some leftovers. Oh wait, hold on. The stories Chance Bear wrote 
are perfect for children. They'll learn important lessons, but also the parents will thank him for the time they gain back each night <laughs> once the kids are asleep. That's so cute. And also, approve. This is exactly what we are looking for. Keep up the great work, Chance. Okay, awesome. I'm very happy. Let's help him find another gate. Ghostwriter for history textbook. Oh, that's cool. And you get paid. 1,300 simoleons almost. Philosophical genius needs writer. <gasps> this gets more pay. I'm putting the final touches on my philosophy book and need a copy editor. It's critical that you contact us. My new thoughts on perspective cannot be delayed any further. Let's go help copy edit for a philosophical genius. What if Sorin and Shigeru plays a game of chess and then once evening time rolls around, we will enroll. That'd be cool, then we'll have the weekends to work on schoolwork and then go to class without much stress. That's a good strategy to have. That's always the strategy I go for if I remember to when it comes to university in the sense. Chance really needs to wind down right now. Chance, go and play the concerto and up your fun a little bit. Everyone's kind of just doing some skill building at the moment, which is great. Very nice stuff. I'm still kind of sad that Sarin's not going to be our, our heir for the legacy. But it's okay. It's okay. I think it's very sweet that we're having a nice time. I'm going to take some photos because Shigeru's going to die soon. I'm preparing my heart for it. Like, no matter what, Shigeru has still been with us for the last... I don't know, 20 plus episodes. I, how many episodes are we on anyways? <laughs> it's been with us for a really long time. Okay, Chance. Oh no, I mean Sorin. Shall we start enrolling you into school right now? Let's enroll. We'll deal with Sorin first. And then we will carry on with Chance. Because Chance is currently trying to feel better about life. We're going to get both of the kids to go to Prochester to study. Sorin could possibly... I can imagine him taking a communications degree. I want them to do distinguished degree. I'm just <sighs> why am I like this? I have no idea. But the better the why would you want to do a non-distinguished degree when you can do a distinguished one? Do you know what I mean? Um yeah, I can totally imagine him being like a civic planner like his father, maybe, but most likely a journalist or a public PR person. Three classes and then let's do a elective. What elective shall we do? What kind of skills do we want to up? for Sorin. He's going to have to move up at some point. So it really does not matter very much because we will have to kind of wean Sorin. I'm gonna go with guitar by the way, but we're going to have to wean Sorin out of our main focus because it's not going to be the air. We're going to study from home until I figure out a way. Maybe if there's not as many things that requires our attention at home, maybe we can move like the future generations into the dormitory. We do have some scholarship. We have $400 off and hopefully we can apply for more scholarships towards the end of this semester and see if we will be able to get more money to subsidize our education. Okay, Saren is now a uni student. Hold on, let me just check this right now. Oh, you can work and study at the same time. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 10 to 7 p.m. But we have three classes that we have to go in on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And we have one class that we'll have to go in on Tuesday and Thursday. And we have one presentation, three exams to do. Sadly, I think we'll have to quit our job that we just accepted. <laughs> so we'll quit the job. We'll focus on studying and we'll just be a uni student right now and the rest of the time that we find will be spent trying to see if he can find the love of his life. If it just so happens that Sauron doesn't end up finding anybody who's not interested in anyone, we'll just accept that he wants to live alone, it's okay. But the thing is Sauron just wants to have a lot of friends, right? I don't know, maybe. I mean, he grew up a very social guy. Anyways, okay, you are done. You're done with this con concerto. You are going to uh, enroll into a university as well, Chance. Thank you very much. Shigeru, please um, go to the bathroom. Thank you. Richester for Chance. What do you guys think? I think he could be a fine... Hmm, musician. If you study fine art, you can become a musician. That's kind of cool. He's really good at music. Or he can study history and become a judge or a politician. Actually, I can see that for him. We're just going to go for all four classes as core classes and let's see how much skills he can raise. Chance does not have to pay a single cent. His education is paid for with how much scholarship he has. I wonder if we get any 
amount of money back. Like, do we get paid? <gasps> we got paid 590 simoleons to study. I love it. I love this system. Let's see what it's like for chance, okay? Two Monday, Wednesday, Fridays and two Tuesdays and Thursdays. And then he has to submit one term paper, one presentation, and two final exams. Got you, okay. Chance has to actually do his, his gig first though. I feel like he could also quit, but maybe we should get that amount of money first. Let him write that one non-fiction book. Go sit down, write that book. Currently, Sauron is already starting with homework. And then Shigeru is just hanging around the house. Oh, and Mindy is back from work. Mindy is very tense. She needs fun, um, she has little energy left. Let's go have her do a yoga routine. Energy centering, I hope that gives her a little bit of energy, a little bit of fun. If it doesn't then oopsies. Okay, Sauron's almost done with his first homework. Let's get him to do his second set of homework as well. I'll check back again when there's something actually exciting going on. Alright, nothing much happened. Um, the whole evening has kind of passed by us. Oh my goodness, no way! No chance, did you save? Oh, he finished the book! Okay, awesome. Oh! Oh no! Oh my god! Oh my god, he literally just said goodbye. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was the bad omen. The computer dying was the bad omen. Oh my god. I mean, I was expecting it, but I did not expect this. Oh my god. <laughs> R.I.P. <laughs> the first one of the bears to die. I am no less sad. <laughs> also guys, while we were like crying over Shigeru, I just literally realized that we had a whole donation bar thing above my head for the first half, maybe even like three quarter of this video. Oh my god, I'm all over the place guys. I'm so sorry. A bit disappointed in myself, but it's okay. It's okay. I hope you guys don't mind. That donation bar thing is actually when I do stream on Twitch. I have that on. It is a stream thing. Just in case you're wondering, but it's off now. I'm so sorry. But anyways, moving on. I wonder where to bury Shigeru actually. Mindy, you have to go back to sleep now. Chance has to go repair his computer. Saren shall go back to sleep. Everyone's upset. We'll have to bury him somewhere. So now my question is where are we going to bury Shigeru? Like where is our family cemetery going to be? It's definitely not going to be with the dogs, right? Can we just place it behind the greenhouse for now? And then we'll exhume him and we'll have Shigeru be um, placed in a proper graveyard. I don't know guys, but Shigeru's going to- you know what? It's actually unfair that we can see, we can see the the pet's tombstone over there as well. We're gonna have to move the pet's one. <laughs> the tombstones of our pets over to the back as well. Now it's fair! Everyone has has a spot behind the greenhouses. It's a very sad arrangement for now but I think it's fine. We'll leave like that for now and then we'll figure it out when we finally do not see lots of snow on the ground and maybe we'll build like a sort of obscure family graveyard area somewhere on this 60 by 60 lot because it's humongous anyways. Also, um, Chance, I know it's 12 a.m. but can you fix your computer? You have to work. And then you can go to sleep once you ask your clients how the book does. Scream, stop standing here, you're being very weird. One does not plead with death before the reaping. He already reaped people. I'm going to be sad. I think Grim's not doing well. No, wait, who is he reaping now? Grim is just hanging around in our house. Oh my god. Grim, leave our house, please. I guess Grim will leave when he wants to leave. Oh, yes! <gasps> wait, Chance got so much more work. I um, mean, so much more money than he, than he was promised. Chance reworked the drafts, tied the ideas together, and maybe learned a little bit about the philosophy of perspective and existence. The client was very, very pleased with himself or pleased with chance depending on perspective. We got paid so much more than just a thousand plus dollars. I mean simoleons. Oh my god, I have to get used to saying that too. Hello? Grim, leave us. Stop being stuck there. Grim is just, death is in the house. How do we make the game understand that they have already taken my father away? <laughs> Can anyone ask the Grim Reaper to leave? Is it part of what's 
possible? No, apparently. Oh, but she can go nature walking. Okay, let's try nature walking. What does it entail? We'll get Mindy to go nature walking at 2 a.m. in the morning. Where are you going? Are you like just walking around talking to plants in the vicinity or something? Maybe that's what nature walking means. And we're really just going to ignore and pretend that we do not see death hanging out in front of my cat's litter box for the rest of this um, episode because what is happening? Where are you heading to in this sad snowy night? She is feeling energized though somehow stimulating stroll it's helping her fun go up so she's just walking in nature is that what she's doing? we'll go back to the kids and see what's happening And what is that sound? Rooster Chick is thinking of leaving soon due to inadequate care. But I, I'm trying my best. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait, is Minnie back yet? Oh, she's still cycling back, okay. Oh my goodness, my chickens are leaving too? What is happening? Actually, before Mindy takes a bath, I think it'll be good if Mindy comes, scatter feed, hatch an egg, clean the coop, check in on the chickens. They're just hungry, are they? Yeah, they're just, they're just starving for some reason. Look at this mess. It's Chance's turn to deal with the plants. I never named my rooster cheek. Does it mean that I have a couple of rooster cheeks and hen chicks to, to name? Okay, um, B. We're still going with the B names, right? Should we go to C now that we are um, a second generation? That will help me. Okay, we'll do Charlie. We're now in Gen 2 anyways, we'll, we'll, we'll start with some C names. Um, it's not going to last for very long though, if I'm being honest, because we're probably not going to keep the chickens for, I mean like the livestock, for much longer. Chance is trying his best, seeing that his gardening skill is not really that good. You know what, guys? Since we have had what we wanted to do done in today's episode, I think I'm going to call it here. It's been quite a long one. And what we're going to do is, I'm going to get everybody to just fix the house and make sure everything goes well before we start next episode next week. So I'll see you guys next week and um, we'll be starting university proper soon and hopefully something incredible is going to happen with Chance and Isla by then so we can get Gen 3 started very soon because I mean university is going to take up quite a bit of the 24 days that every sim has as a young adult just studying and not pursuing anything else in life so we're going to try to see about that we might set a goal that we will get Sarin out in the world and try to find someone anyways thank you so much for coming back and watching this episode if you guys have stuck with me since episode one i appreciate you so much if you just found this series and you would like to watch from the start there is a full playlist listed down below and also you can find it on my channel and stuff where you can watch from episode one onwards thank you so much for taking an interest in this little legacy and if you've been waiting for my return thank you so much for your patience as well i hope i do not disappoint you further with my my disappearance remember to subscribe like this video if you liked it subscribe to this channel if you have not yet subscribed it will really really help me out it will support my channel and let me know that people want to watch my content and yeah i'll see you guys next week for the next episode remember to also follow me on all my social media everything is going to be listed down below um i think that's it i cannot remember what i used to say but this is pretty much what i wanted to say so thank you so much i'll see you bye guys